Hello, everyone. ATB is here with you today, bringing spiritual messages, always with God's permission. Today, I will bring you messages from the spirits. I will ask you to be in a connection with me of positive energy, because the spirits that are here, through God's permission, are spirits of light and love. Many come closer and send messages, and I will bring these messages to you. The ones that resonate, you accept them. If not, throw them into the universe. There are several entities that present themselves. So there will be several messages. I am sure that some are directly for you. I ask you to share them, leave a like, and subscribe to the channel. I see that some of you are being blamed for something that is not your fault. This guilt does not belong to you. And here I see a great opportunity coming into your life. Spirituality is announcing that it will be given to you the opportunity to have the wealth that you are manifesting. Many of you ask God, pray, manifest, make promises, and pray because you want to have financial stability. You want to become millionaires, billionaires, rich people. Share with God that the moment you have all this money, you will be helping other people and your family. You will be serving divine purposes. So many of you who have this connection with the spiritual world are manifesting this wealth, manifesting this financial stability. And here spirituality is uh, saying that you have the power to have all the wealth you desire. What prevents you from acquiring all this money, all this billionaire purpose that is in your millionaire consciousness today is fear. Spirituality says that when a person is afraid, they give their mind to the devil because the devil, evil, whatever you want to call it, depends on your beliefs. But the evil that exists in the spiritual world controls people through the fear that settles in the person's mind. So the spirits are saying that this negative energy that is preventing you from taking action and having the courage to start what you know can make you a billionaire will hold you back for the rest of your life. If you do not get rid of this fear, these spirits are announcing that, yes, you will have the necessary minds, the necessary tools to begin your divine purpose that will lead you to your financial stability. Your great happiness in uh, meeting your purposes, your desires, and your soulmate. And uh, it also talks about you discovering the greatest secret of your life. It also talks about you letting go of a habit. You have the habit of alienation. So I, I, I see that for you, you are people that the spirits are saying that flattery is not part of your life, nor the seduction that people can offer you, incredible, extraordinary things. But that your intuition reads the person's soul and knows when the person really has a true intention towards you or is just there flattering. So this spiritual gift and several other spiritual gifts that you have, they, and they are the path, the sign, that you need to start this new project in your life. Because you are people who do not work in vanity. You are people who do not work in egocentrism. You have a very advanced soul. So God knows. Um, and he knows all things. And the spirits here confirm that whatever you're going to do that will earn those millions, you will become that billionaire person. You will not make you self-centered and vain people. You will know how to share. You will know how to share. You will be grateful. You will be worthy of what comes to you. Your family situation will change, but you have to remove anxiety and fear from your mind, because that is what gets in the way. That is what brings doubt. And as I said before, the devil works in our minds through fear and doubt. When we have doubts, we have no faith. We have no faith in ourselves or in the one who created us. This is the open door for darkness to enter. Don't let this happen. You will have a great opportunity to set up the business of your life the billion dollar business of your life, the project of your life. You will have your own business. You will have your own brain activity being highlighted. 
People will look for you, they will invest in you because you will show wisdom, a knowledge that you have that is unique. So you will be sought after people within your life condition, within your reality, in your life. You will have what you desire financially. So here I see that many of you have to start developing spiritual gifts. Of you to achieve your goals, I see that you look for those who are single here. The spirits are saying that you want a more solid relationship in your life. Oh, you talk to God and say that the people you relate to play with your feelings are people who do not see the value. And many times are people who criticize you. And here, spirituality is saying that if you are single, if you are single, it is because these spirits want you to first allow yourself to have your wealth and prosperity so that you can then find your soulmate. Because when your soul is carrying out its spiritual task. It will find the soul that will also be carrying out its spiritual task. And then the meeting of soulmates takes place. So if at this moment you are feeling lonely, don't look back because the spirits are here saying that maybe people from your past will come because they are seeing that your light is increasingly radiant. Leave these people behind. There is no one from your past. Your soulmate is in the same movement that you are now. Of change to achieve your divine purpose, then she will meet you. There will be the meeting of soulmates. You will be loved. You will be loved. You will have someone who will be on this path, in this purpose, creating this empire with you. Creating this empire with you, some of you will. End a relationship because of an ex-boyfriend or because of family issues. Some of you will move away from a person that you are realizing that this person no longer pays attention to. You no wonder you do not respect. You, I see separations and I see endings. And I also see that some of you after this separation will cross borders because the spirits are announcing other distant lands that you may be going to distant lands starting over something that will lead you to this extreme abundance, wealth, prosperity, and meeting of soulmates. Spirituality says that this week, this month, you will have a legal issue that will make you sad. Something about division of assets or payments, but they tell you not to be discouraged because spirituality is cleaning up everything that no longer serves you in your life. It is settling accounts to take you for this new cycle, this new dimension. Thank you and see you soon.